accused of attempted capital murder, bringing his son's trial to a halt. The mid-trial courtroom outburst interrupted the trial of Darnell Rogers. Paul Venema has more on that outburst and the reaction, which might surprise you. Yes. Darnell Rogers is on trial on attempted capital murder charges. At his request, he's been acting as his own lawyer. As he questioned a witness, Rogers' father suddenly stood up and requested to be called as a witness. His son had a surprising reply. I don't want to call him as a witness. I'm, I'm ready to proceed with this. I was just asking, could he be uh, mentally evaluated? I see no reason to mentally evaluate Mr. Rogers. With the jury quickly excused, Judge Kevin O'Connell elaborated on his decision. He's made his decisions, and he's, he's continuing to make them. So if he doesn't want this man as a witness, that's his call. Outside the courtroom, Roger's father said that he had information that his son could use in his defense. And he also explained why he asked to participate in the trial. So now, ain't in the right state of mind no more. He been locked up. I don't mean just in jail. He been in isolation. Throughout the trial, Roger seems to have validated the judge's competency evaluation. Throughout the trial, he's been an active participant as he cross-examined prosecution witnesses. You say, uh, E5 is a, is a bully. Rogers was involved in a shootout with deputy constables 18 months ago. They weren't hit. He was shot and is paralyzed from the waist down. Paul Venema, KSAT 12 News.